What is up guys, Awesome Nerd Show here, back again playing Ark Survival Evolved, and we're here today for what I'm going to be calling the season finale, because um, this is going to be the last time I probably play on this map, at least for a little while. Like, I'm going to leave everything, so this, everything, the base and all the dinos will still remain. Nothing will change. Um, it's just, uh... I will be playing on this any longer because with new games coming out and then I will be switching over to Ragnarok whenever I do start playing again. Um, so I'm here on a T-Rex which is a new Rex because it is a uh, spawned one because since I'm uh, what I'm gonna do today which I have not even uh, brought this stuff with me but I'm going to do the raid bosses is what I'm going to do today so that's uh, kind of what I'm out here to do so I'm gonna be walking over to the green obelisk so it's gonna take quite a while obviously to get there um, but I'm gonna be walking the Rex and so I have this tamed wreck or Rex that I spawned in or whatever it's at max level and then um, I've got God mode, at least I believe I have God mode and infinite stats on it and myself. And I'm just going to be taking on the alpha raid boss because, you know, I'm here by myself. So there's uh, no way I could probably really do this um, all by myself without taking a lot more time to do it, which I don't really have. So I'm just kind of going with the flow, as you could say. Um, and so I just got me and this one Rex, but hopefully, like I said, with the stats on it, and hopefully by transporting like through worlds and stuff from, uh, you know, going into the worlds with the raid bosses and everything that, uh, hopefully I can, uh, still keep the stats on. If not, I can try and type them in real quick or something, but hopefully I can actually kill it. So I'm gonna, um, obviously, uh, do a thing or whatever to get the levels onto the T-Rex here and I'm gonna power up, uh, probably melee damage since I have infinite stats whatever I don't have to really worry about health or anything um, I'll probably walk on this side of the beach so I don't get attacked by anything flying out but I'm gonna do the uh, spider first because I believe it is the easier of the t of the three available on this game so I'll do that one and then if depending on how much time there is and stuff um, I'll try and move to the other sort of stego egg there so I'm going to walk over to the green obelisk and once I get there we'll put all the stuff into the thing and go into the spider layer or whatever you want to call it and uh, hopefully we can get this done and not just sit there and take forever since I just have one dino. Um, but I'll make it over there and I'll be right back. Okay so I made it to the obelisk. I guess I should probably move the Rex and I got the levels put onto the Rex so hopefully this will all work out. So let's go ahead and access the thing. So I have everything to put in here. And so we will do the alpha. And craft this. So here we go. We're going into it. I'm super nervous. Hopefully all the commands still stay with the making stuff invincible. And I powered the T-Rex up. He's got 10,000 melee damage. So hopefully that'll do some damage to the Titan Boa. Or, I don't know why I call it Titan Boa. The Broodmother. I think that's what it's called, right? Yeah, I think that's the giant spider. Um, and so hopefully, like I said, it'll do... Whoa. Enough damage to that. Oh, there it is right there. So let's attack. Let's see what it does. So we're doing damage to it. And it's doing damage to this, but our stat thing is helping keep it up, which is awesome. Hopefully it doesn't get low enough to where we die. Oh goodness. So I'm not dying, it's level staying up, and of course it's got stamina. So I see 6,000 going on there. And so it's going pretty fast here, so I may do a whole sped up thing here, maybe not, I don't know. We'll just see how it goes, but I'm just going to sit here and click.
and here we are about to do it and there we go we did it Woo! so we got the spider and all that sort of stuff so let's see if I don't know if you can harvest anything from it doesn't really look like it oh that's kind of cool let's I was gonna say let's see if we can eat it but I don't know if the I don't know if we're really getting anything from it let's see what does the t-rex have on it it's not what I wanted because I know you got to be off the t-rex or something will happen so it's got chitin and it doesn't really have anything on it so I have stuff I have the broodmother trophy oh they've really upgraded that that's awesome so I do have some of the Halloween related stuff that I did get from it which is uh, kind of cool I guess which I meant to mention that I was doing the Halloween event or was going to do a video for you guys but uh, something happened and so it's only on like official servers and we made it Woo! Um, but the Halloween events only on official servers so you can't uh, really get it oh I was like what is that um, so you can't really get it from anything else like there's supposedly a command but I couldn't figure it out or get it to work so I'm just not gonna really deal with it or mess with it so we got the brood mother done so oh, come on you stupid t-rex what are we stuck on and so now we're gonna go to the snow biome and try the mesopithecus which I believe is what it's called at least but the giant ape so I will now this is the only bad part walking this thing so I will now walk the t-rex all the way over to there and we will try that one out so once I reach that I will bring it right back and we will face that one and see how it goes so once I get there I'll bring it right back okay so I made it up to the blue obelisk finally that took quite a while didn't seem as long as the uh, last one did though so let's go ahead and insert all of these th things here to summon it and we'll do the alpha once again so here we go hopefully uh, the t-rex should make it in just fine hopefully so we're going now to fight the giant Megapith Megapithicus. Hopefully it will be um, just as easy or similar to the uh, spider, the broodmother. Um, so hopefully it won't take very long. And let's do this. So we got three, two, one. Oh, there's a little flicky hands of, of the thing. Okay, so we are now here. So let's get the T-Rex turned around. Horrible thing about T-Rexes is they take forever. Actually, I, th I don't know where I want to fight this thing. Maybe up in here? Because I don't know what kind of knockback it has. So there it is. So of course, yeah, I'll have a bunch of monkeys coming in with it. Flinging poop and everything. good that he's getting me all knocked around and everything oh shoot so there is knockback especially I don't know if it's with these things or what but there's definitely some uh, knockback going on here hopefully it does not knock me off of a cliff or anything Of course with the T-Rex it's hard to hit a lot of these things. And we'll just say if we can able to stay right here. Hopefully if we can just keep hitting it. He's gonna hit me with the rocks. It's almost a half health. This one's going a lot faster, it seems like. Throw your rocks at me. It's about down to half health right now. All these stupid 
mega pith kisses or whatever. So yeah, this one's definitely going a lot faster. If I can just stay on it. It's hard since it knocks you around and everything. And we got the monkeys again. I just want to hit that one. There we go. Ooh, that knocked me back really far. Oh, must be the monkey poop. I'm like, why am I not able to move? Come on, it's almost dead. Oh gosh, it's behind me again. Oh, God, I need to get turned around. Here we go. Ah, oh, dang it. It's hard to hit this guy. Here we go. Cause he moves around, it's the monkey things are knocking me around. Here we go again, some hits on him again. He's almost dead now. See just a few more hits. There we go. Awesome. So there we got the Mega Pithecus, I I don't know exactly what it's called. Yeah, Mega Pithecus. So let's just jump off of here so we're prepared. You stupid monkey. It's weird how they don't have like any inventory stuff or anything. But let's... That's not what I wanted once again. Let's see, does the T-Rex have anything on it? Except all this stuff, which we can drop all of this. It's got a lot of meat. What's its weight? Ah, it's still got a lot of weight. Can drop all of that. It's awesome. Oh, this time we got the Santa hat. Awesome. And the flag. Oh, there it goes. Alpha trophy of the head. So there we are back now. So now the last one is the dragon. So that is... Oh, there's a drop right there. I don't know exactly where... That drop is. Okay, so it's over this direction. Which kind of the nice thing about uh, this is that we can just fall off the side. <laughs> Since it's got uh, the whole damage stuff and everything. So let's just see if we can like fall down the side over here. Oh goodness. Oh. There you got one of the Uteranus things. So I want to see if there's a, yeah there is one. An artifact here. There we go. So we got an artifact. So now I'm gonna head down to the red obelisk and do the next one. So I will try and walk my way down there now and I will see you then. Okay and so we got our last stop here. Oops. I always want to try and make sure that the T-Rex is in the middle as cl close as possible so I don't lose it. Let's check its inventory. So obviously killed some stuff along the way. We'll drop that. We'll keep the fur on there though. Oh yeah, we got that brain. Of course can drop a lot of this stuff. Just to try and lose some of the weight off of it. Because obviously we don't need all this stuff. There we go. Let's get rid of all the 19s there. And then let's check my inventory. Of course I have all of 
Oh no. We've lagged out. Okay, so. Looks like we have some stuff over here we can get rid of. We have all of these. I don't need that, don't need that, don't need those. And of course this is all the stuff for the new thing. Okay, so let's go ahead and give me all that stuff. Okay, so let's go ahead and look at all this stuff in there. So let's go ahead and transfer all of the, whoops, I need that element. Transfer all of this. And we can now summon, which I will, when we get done, I will craft, or I guess I won't, I thought I had all the stuff. But um, at some point I'll craft the replicator, probably not today though, obviously. Um, and since I'll have all the um, Ingrams and stuff now. Why does my guy look all weird like this? I don't remember him looking like this. But anyways, um, so this is going up, so I'll obviously have 20 seconds or so, so let's... Now I think the dragon's a little bit tough because I think it flies around and stuff so that can be a problem. Um, not exactly sure. Hopefully we can do this relatively easy. Let's hope. So let's jump on here. And go across the bridge over here hopefully. Oh, I see. Oh, there it is. Let's go over here and hopefully the dragon will land by us over here. Maybe. Or come down towards us. Come on, little dragon. I know he's breathing fire upon us. So I know this is the only bad thing is that it likes to fly around a lot. Kaboom. Come down. I like how it's all... Oh no, it broke my stuff. I forgot about wearing armor and everything. Are you gonna come down, dragon? I just wanna take a bite of you. Yes, come down. So I will fight it here because it looks like it's going to be a little slower. Oh, maybe not. Looks like it's going relatively fast actually. But I'll probably just be clicking a lot so here I go. Oh no, he flew away. Come back, dragon. What? How did I die? Huh. That was weird. That's so weird that I died like that. Like, how did that happen? Oh, that sucks, because that means I've lost everything. Oh my gosh. Why is my guy, like, in such a weird... Oh, did, oh I must have turned the thing. Huh. 
Well, I guess that's one way to end it. Um, I doubt it, but let's fly over and see if anything, any of our stuff is just sitting there. That's so weird how I died. Like, I don't get how I died if I had the stats and everything on. Unless somehow, uh, it was, the stuff was taken off of me. I don't know. Let's just fly over here real quick. To see, like I said, I'm pretty sure I just lost everything. What you mean I had stuff I, oh, I mean I lost the... Mega Pithecus stuff and all that sort of things. So that kind of sucks, but it's not like it really matters. I mean, I never had it before and all my important stuff I had left uh, back at the base. So it's not like I lost anything I didn't have already. Yeah, I don't see any bags or anything, which I didn't really expect to. But that just kind of sucks. Like I said, I don't know, you know, with having the stats on and stuff, I don't know how I died or anything but let's see I got oh yeah one of my lungs is still in there so I still have all that stuff I do have oh I do have a Christmas can I have the hats and all sorts of suit things but that's really all I got well I guess we'll fly back to the base Three, two, one. Okay, so we're back at the base now. So I guess that's going to be it then. I guess uh, <laughs> I've just lost all that stuff. Like I said, I think I have all my weapons and stuff. Of course, I lost my armor. I have my weapons and stuff over there on Stomper and everything. But I guess that's probably going to be it for the game then. Uh, here on the island, like I said, we'll be doing um, the Ragnarok, I think, next is what I'll be moving to. I don't know exactly when it'll start because there's new games coming out like Call of Duty this Friday. Um, then Battlefront coming out two weeks after that. And those are two games I'm going to be playing a lot. I'm going to try to start doing streaming and stuff. So if you want to watch me stream, um, you can like watch out on social media and uh, maybe some stuff on YouTube or whatever. I'll put a thing back out that I'm streaming and stuff. But... Um, I guess that's about it for this arc. Like I said, everything's still going to be here. Nothing's going to change or anything. Um, and then if like certain events or stuff happen, some you know stuff sort of stuff goes on, I'll come back here and do it on this game. And of course, I may play randomly on this um, every now and then. But I guess that's pretty much it for the game. Like I said, that's it for the island here. So um, I hope you all enjoy this. Like when I first started this season, it was kind of just a random thing because I had been playing the um, Pokemon version on this and this was where I established a base and stuff and then um, I got tired of the Pokemon because it wasn't exactly perfect so I just switched back over the arc and just started playing from there so it was didn't really have a f official start of a season or anything like that and so I built a base built a giant stable barn and then something happened with the game and it all disappeared so I had to rebuild the base and have all of this stuff so the house over there and everything and they of course have taming pin the uh, greenhouse and of course this giant stable which I think is really cool I really like it oh look we can look under the ground that's cool um, but I think that's probably gonna be it for this episode so it's just a sad teary goodbye do you see any tears coming out of my eyes nope probably not my blue blue eyes 
But that's going to be it for this. I hope you all enjoyed. Please leave any comments you have for me down below. Hit the like if you enjoyed. And don't forget to subscribe. And we will see you next time. <laughs>